funding. A Harlingen woman faces eviction and could be left homeless in just two weeks. And she says her mortgage company is making it nearly impossible for her to fight to keep her home. Action Force Daisy Martinez tells us why in tonight's Call for Action. Daisy. Well, Marcy registered nurse Elizabeth Noble was injured and lost her job about six years ago. She's been struggling financially but was granted disability benefits this February to help, help her pay her home. But her mortgage company says it's just too late. I was preventing the patient from bleeding to death. Elizabeth Noble dedicated more than 20 years of her life working as a registered nurse at a local hospital. And while trying to save a patient's life after a cardiac catheter was causing them to bleed out, her career and life took a drastic turn. And that pressure to hold that person for bleeding is just, just a little bit, of like 10 minutes max. I held on to the bleeding area for over an hour. That episode tore a ligament in her shoulder, which prevented her from getting her job back and set her back financially, especially when it came to payments on her home. And I was paying it nice and automatic withdrawals, and then I have the everything taken away because they denied my ability to work. After years of waiting, Noble was finally approved for disability benefits and received her first check in May. She was optimistic that she would be able to save her home from foreclosure. But her mortgage company, American Home Mortgage, didn't see things her way. Now they're saying, well, we need um, two months of bank statements. This is the current thing now. I said, well, how am I going to get two months of bank statements when they just started the deposits a month ago? Noble needs more time, she says, to try and salvage the only place she has to call home. And just before news time, we spoke to the American Home Mortgage Company, and they have placed a hold on this closure. They will grant Noble more time to provide them with the paperwork they need to save her home. Live in the studio, Daisy Martinez, Action for News. Thanks, Daisy.